Uh, well, let me start by saying that any time you're, uh, it's not fun, and it's uh, certainly not a, not easy when you get fired. I mean, that's a that's that's a bad day. Okay, that's that's not a good day at the office. And uh, I do want to thank. Uh, I got a lot of. I've been here nine years, and I got a lot of good memories and a lot of people, uh, players, coaches, fans. Uh, in a nine-year period of time that uh, I've been really lucky and fortunate to be around to, uh, to have a chance to, to be a part of them. Uh, and I wouldn't take anything for that. Uh, I, I, I do want to say that, uh, you know, to, to our people, we got, we got some really good fans. And, uh, but they got to stand up right now. Okay, they, 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 and sometimes when you're the head coach, you, you can't say things because if you do, you, it's kind of sour grapes. You know, you know, I mean, you, you can't say exactly the way it is. And, uh, but, you know, I mean, what I would say to them is, is now is the time to stand up for your university and your football program. I'm a seventh straight coach that stands here saying the same things to you. Okay, this is the seventh straight time this has happened. And history will continue to repeat itself, folks, if, if they don't do something about it. You got whoever, whoever they hire, they'll hire a good guy. Okay, and I'll pull for him. Okay, but they, you, you, our fans have got to demand. You, you got to do one of two things. You have to demand that you give him an equal stick to fight with within our conference. You got to give him a level playing field. To, to, to fight. Give him that. Stobart stood here the same way. Okay, Stobart became a bad coach. Wouldn't recruit and he was a bad coach. But he was good enough to beat Southern Cal and, and, and Rip became a bad coach and wouldn't recruit. But he could beat Peyton Manning in Tennessee. And we could beat Eli in his senior year. And, it, and Ole Miss again the next year down there. And, and, went, and, and at some point in time, you got to say, right, we got to help this football program. We got to do the things necessary to make this what we want it, or do away with it. And I couldn't say that as a coach, but you got to do one other because it's too painful. It's painful for coaches, for players, and for people, for fans. It's painful. Put something in it or do away with it. One or the other. That's what they should do. And I don't say that in a negative way. I've been here nine years. I got nine years of my life invested here. Hard years. Hard years. Fighting years, every day a fist fight to try to move this program. I don't say any of it in a negative way. I say it in a very positive way because I want to see this program be successful. The only other thing I would say is you got to somehow take the negative out of it. you got to find a way to get the negative surrounding this thing out of it. I don't know how you do it. I don't know if you can do it. Okay, but you got to do that okay, because there is a group. There is a negativity like nowhere I've ever coached. I've coached a lot of places. This is the only place. There's a negativity here that in any end eats you up. It's hard to win. Today's game, it's harder to win than it's ever been. And if you got to fight battles around your own program and around your own campus and around your own city, it's hard. It makes it, it may, makes it very difficult. All, if you want to be, don't be negative. Ask what you can do to help the football program. What can I, instead of being negative about the coach or the team, what can I do to help it? How can I bring somebody, well, come to a game and bring somebody with you. Do that for the next guy. Give him a fighting chance. I wish somebody, just like, just like our, and I'm not picking on our paper, but I would, instead of writing the sarcastic, smart aleck remark articles, why don't call me and ask me, Coach, what can I do to help your football program? I, I, we love this city, we love this university, and we love this football program. And we'd love to see it be How can I help it? Instead of running it down all the time. When it doesn't go exactly right, running it down. Do something to help give the next guy a fighting chance. That's what I would ask all of our fans. But, but to our fans, demand that he get a fighting chance or give it up, one or the other. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, again, um, 3 o'clock at the Athletic Complex, located